and no, we are not surprised because we know this government. Over and the, over the time, time, time uh, it laps, they, they have not been following in terms of law, they have not been following the, the constitution. They are using it time and again. So people of Zimbabwe must stand up and rise because this is not the, the first time they did so. <coughs> Hello guys, so come back from the TV. From the top line, I want to say that my update is route transport match. Man, any kind of demand you want to get to Ma, nirana wa ndine na wenda kwa trip na pama update is a swear of shit. Kakuma ba election as we all know, kuti zeki ato zora mbiza shakanya ni kukonde sta kuma MP A triple C kuti angi ya chipinda pama ba elections anasi. No kudaro apana kana MP A triple C a kwanza ukasta his vote a kum ko maba election emswa nasi but makanzela abanga vachivota asi izvi zvarwadza zvakanyanya avagari vemumabvukta fara uye izvi zvanyanya kurwadza ama MPA triple C anga achifanirwa kupinda kumaba elections anasi awa akakonzeswa na chabangu na ari kunzi iye is an illegal imposter ari kuklema iye kuti ndi secretary general we triple C guys ndikana kupedzera ngo ndauti kuti muzvinhu zviri kumega apa zvino kana mashuku ari kutaurwa na honorable munyaradzi kufa kuti we are going to be MP with Triple C. We are going to be MP with Triple C. Agasti this year and then do not move the wash of no fungum comment section after material ama shoka ruta on a makufa good is we no good out of our crates a kushush can and a shaka itika it's very rare good you can a one girls one one uri we was sorrows one ma millions and millions of one and then one goes so nzi awa wicha kwa zero kunge or she pita pashi garocha wapi wa hicho to guys ngaru pezera nguwa jins grew up at this video most on that one no fungum comment section as crazy first time i got to be here i will come subscribe by mahara for more information for more updates. Uh, no, we are not surprised because we know this government. Over and the, over the time, time, time uh, it laps, they, they have not been following in terms of law, they have not been following the, the constitution. They are urinating on the constitution time and again. So people of Zimbabwe must stand up and rise because this is not the, the first time they did so. Because currently what we, we, we know and what we believe, Zan people want to make sure that they crush the voice of the opposition. They want to crush the very little democracy space which we have. So they are squeezing us to the bone, and I believe they want to, to, to push us uh, as a nation to one party state. This will then enable them to do whatever they want without any voice which will, which will then uh, challenge them. So currently we believe that uh, they did this so that they, uh, they attain a two-third majority, and of which they, if they attain that, they also want to amend the constitution so that him Munayawa will then become the life president. But as us as Zimbabwe, it's, it's high time we need to stand up, because we can't continue being rude or being governed by this uh, heartless government. Currently, we, we, if, if they know that they, they really want to, to, to take this through the court, because currently the, man, the people's mandate was not driven, it was not driven from the courts or from Zeki. I was elected by the people of Mokugu and Tafara uh, on the 20th of, uh, of August. Like what I said before, that I still kept that mandate and I believe I've got the people's heart. Like what I said before, earlier on uh, during uh, my days of recall, I said you can take me out of parliament or, or any government institution, but you will never take me out of the minds and the heart of people. So I still believe the people of my group, I still kept their mandate. So uh, generally, uh, what they want to do uh, is just to, 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 to drive us into one party, like what I said before. So we are not moved, but we are still focused, and people are really angry. I think the community is angry. People have been flogging this place since morning, trying to check and understand the logic of, of law. So in this country, there is no law. I think everything is captured. He captured judiciary, everything. They captured every state institution has been captured. So we, we, are, we, are, we are now, uh, they are now commanding almost, almost every institution. So this is a command judiciary system. So these are the results. And uh, as of us, I was saying to my